uh, I informed up to 11 o'clock, we will be discussing on 5S, KSN, and SMED. And that means we can spend about 20 to 25 minutes on each topic. And let's use it effectively. Now, the seven ways we already covered. Right, 5S. What is 5S? It's simply, put it in simple, it is a workplace organizing tool. How do we keep our house? How do we keep our you know, uh, living place? Same way we should maintain our workplace also, right? In our uh, work environment also. Ultimately, we wanted to create a safer and smarter facility to all the stakeholders whether it is the your boss or it is you or it is your operator or it is your customer coming inside your uh, company your workplace it should give them you no know, exhibit the same thing it should be safer and smarter right so what is this 5 years first step is sort second step is set in order third step is shine Fourth one is standardized, fifth one is sustained. I'll talk about all the five. In Japanese language, they call it with certain words. I really do not remember, but I can help you by reading out, right? Sort in Japanese language, it is called Shiri. And then set in order is Seton. Shine is Shisho. And standardized is Sekichu. And then final one, sustain is Shichuke. What is this sorting? Sorting is eliminating waste sorting is eliminating waste in japanese language waste is muda eliminate all the mudas all the waste particularly the first one all physical items which are not necessary to carry out your productive work all physical items which are not necessary to carry out carry out your productive work for example i have two water bottles in my table now, one of the water bottle, I don't think will be helpful. I just need to keep only one. The remaining one, I will remove. This is called sorting. This is called sorting. We will also try to go deeper. Not just identify the unnecessary item. We will also go to the extent of finding out the unnecessary activities we may do. Unnecessary item removal is one thing. And uh, stopping to do unnecessary activity is the next layer of understanding. The third layer of understanding is, I will advise you to avoid even unnecessary thinking when you are in a workplace. When you are in a workplace, when you think about you know, the celebration in a party, that will definitely pull down your productivity. Hope all of you understand. And remove the unnecessary item, and then remove the unnecessary activities, and if possible, try to remove the unnecessary thinking. Where you implement depends on uh, to what depth you can implement the yes. If you make your people think only about the productive work, you are the best manager. You are the best organization, right? And this is the power of the first yes called the sort. Set in order. Set in order, just imagine our house where we keep all the cooking items only in kitchen we don't keep all the you know our uh, provision items in our bedroom we never do that if you have a habit of st storing you know all the stock of sugar in your bedroom will you be able to sleep we can't isn't it so there has to be a place for everything and then everything should be in its place at any moment all of you are with me on the second point set in order is there has to be a place for everything. I come to your house, I need to remove my shoe, and then I need to come inside your room. But after removing my shoe, where should I keep it? If, if such arrangement is made, then second S is implemented in your workplace. Can you think in the same manner? Every item, a small piece of item, do you have an address for it? Do you have a specific location for it? Is that location perfectly suits it? That is called set in order. If I have, if you have a place where only in that place people can, you know, 
put their shoes when they come out of your house they can quickly pick it back and then move out of your house everything is productive isn't it in case if there is no such a provision i will i will remove my shoe in any place i want and somebody can push it to some other place when i come out then now i have to search for my shoe do you understand this is what happens typically in marriage halls we put the shoe get inside the function when we come out our shoes will not be there right maybe a brand new but somebody could have already you know uh, grabbed it or they could have kept it in some other place things gets mixed up and now now our time will get wasted this is this is how you know the waste will slowly one by one will pop up there are seven types of waste all the seven will happen if you don't follow all the five years seriously now the third years what is third years shine whether it is the shirt you wear or it is the pant you wear or it is the shoe you wear it should know shine well so that people can appreciate the way you are working imagine you have a printer in your house do you want to keep the printer neat and clean definitely so my printer is fantastically neat fabulously clean but when i want to take a print out it is not helping me does it mean your printer is shining definitely no so we need to clean at the same time we need to see to that our equipment is always under working condition you need to include all these things under the third s which is shine hope all of you understand right so it's not just a mere cleaning job you need to do of course we all have to you know take a cloth and clean our uh, table clean our uh, laptop clean our uh, you no know, keyboard and everything by ourselves but the deep cleaning will be done by maybe the sanitary department you have a separate housekeeping department they will come and do the deep cleaning but day to day cleaning who should clean your table you should clean if you think everything somebody else will do then you will not be able to shine in your job right and that's the meaning and uh, one thing is cleaning other thing is maintenance please you know combine the words to understand the third s it is not only cleaning cleaning plus maintenance upkeeping of the equipment in a way that it is always productive hope the third s is understood fourth s standardize can you make all the three s as your habit as your habit every time i come to your house unconsciously i will put my footwear only in the place you have allotted for the visitors i am not you know a familiar guy with your house i am just you know a guest i come once in a year but you are making me to put my shoe only in the shoe rack that means you have standardized the things like you know anything people just cannot escape from following your first 3 s this is called standardizing whether you are doing or a stranger is doing the output is same whether a semi skilled operator is doing or a highly skilled operator is doing or an unskilled fellow is doing the job your result is always same this is called standardization every day every shift 10 minutes is for cleaning this is standardization a work has to be performed only in a particular way that is standardization right so the fourth s make sure the first three s are followed on a regular basis clear this is called a standardize sustain what is sustain the results achieved from the first four s are retained find out the ways by which the results produced by the first four s are retained for a long longer time or it never vanishes it should never you should not let it you no know, go down see to that your people are always motivated see to that your people are you no know, gently you are you are you are threatening the people gently in such a way that they follow all the four s do you understand the fourth s makes you follow the first three the fifth s makes you follow all the four 
you have already standardized but you understood that it should be improved further so what do you do so you will improve my shoe rack you know i bought a beautiful shoe rack but the size is not sufficient now i will go for the second level of standardization right so all these things should happen you know in a cyclic manner and i will also find the ways by which my people are motivated enough guided enough right so that they follow all the forests and the results produced will never go down if there can be only upward journey and there is never a downward journey that job is called what sustain it can be some awards it can be some rewards it can be certain audits isn't it it can be some appreciation figure out certain ways so this is in essence five yes hope it is clear to all of you and probably i will show lot of slides but may talk less because the slides itself will speak that is the power of fivers in your workplace also your workplace itself will get you business you don't have to do anything you keep it in a particular way that will start generating revenue for you that will keep motivating everybody your employees as well as your customers as well as new customer when i come to your place i will be tempted to give order to you that's how no i maintain fivers in my workplace <clears throat> now i want uh, you people to play a small game with me right and uh, few of you can come on video already i could see alok and mr magesh and few more can come on video or all of you can be on video there are certain numbers i have uh, put on the screen what i do i want one of you to take control of my screen that means this cursor you will be able to move right and then i will tell you what you need to do when that person is doing a job all other black belts here can support him can help him is that clear instruction operational definition now who is going to control my you know uh, cursor now i will give the control to you who is willing who is willing i'll do that sir okay mr magesh so mr magesh i have given you the control can you try can you try moving my cursor now from your uh, keypad yeah you are moving now i am not moving you got okay. the control. now yes. i want magesh to find out the numbers from 1 to 49 listen the instruction very carefully he has to find out the numbers from 1 to 49 in the same sequence 1 and then 2 and then 3 all others can can guide mr magesh all others i want to see that each one of you is contributing i don't want anybody to be idle each one should contribute you can tell magesh whatever you want finally magesh should be able to figure out and let us understand what happens let us understand how effective magesh is let us also understand how efficient magesh is effectiveness is finding out all numbers efficiency is doing it very fast tell me magesh from for for figuring out the numbers from 1 to 1 on one on the left yes, yes, down yes. side yes yes very good uh, before one one last instruction no. below 54 ah just, oh, one just, second sir one second one second wait 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 you can start the game one more minute tell me mr magesh what do you think how much time you may require to do this task in terms uh, of minutes or in terms of seconds uh 1 to no, no, 49 up to 49 1 to 49 may require up to 3 minutes all right so i am going to give 3 minutes and let me you know evaluate Uh, mr magesh and his teams efficiency sir one question just one question before starting yes yes uh, how do we uh, how do we do we circle the numbers or do we no no he will only show the cursor that's all he will show the laser pointer on the number okay already identified one isn't uh, it uh, but then I, then he has to move to number 2 okay he should go up to 49 okay clear so he gets there to uh, 68 Sorry, about, shall we start? I will shall start, start my clock. I will start my clock. Sir, shall I do that? <coughs> yes, sir. Yes, please. please. I will give you three minutes. That means one hundred and eighty seconds. Here you go. You can start. Okay. Right, sir. This is one. 
this is two, two. above yeah again two three is left top three, three at top yeah. left correct four, four, four is above six to zero nine. Top nine left top to zero nine, nine. Five above forty one this is five oh, okay then six this is, is six. just above four yeah yeah this is seven seven this is eight then eight is eight. around forty three. Yeah, this is nine, nine is right top nine. corner yeah. above eighteen. Above eighteen. Yeah, this nine. is nine. Ten, ten is, is ten. next to fifty-four. Bottom yeah, left. Ten. Yes, eleven. Eleven is eleven above, above sixty-four. Just above. Twelve 10. is just near to fifty-seven. Yeah, right. Yes, this is twelve. Then thirteen. Yeah, thirteen. Mm -hmm. Thirteen. Thirteen is right bottom. Below fifty-eight. Yeah. Bottom fifty-eight. Middle. Bottom. Yeah, yeah. Below fifty-eight. Bottom middle is thirteen. Yeah, thirteen. Okay. Bottom center, yes. Ah, uh, fourteen is next to thirty-two. Big thirty-two. Just to yeah, big thirty-two above. on the yes. center of your screen. Right above thirteen. Fourteen. The left. This is fifteen. Yeah, right. Okay. And sixteen. 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 I think sixteen there is, is no the bottom. Sixteen uh, is bottom, bottom left. Bottom. Right sixteen bottom. Is larger number. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, sixteen. Right, yeah. Right, yeah. Right. This is sixteen. Yes, this is sixteen. Then above, this is seventeen. Seventeen above. Yeah. Seventeen above. That. Yeah. Eighteen is on the top. Eighteen at upside. From there up. Corner. Second row from the nine. Yeah, this it's better yeah, if you say row and column. Ah, huh? second row. Yeah, that one. This is eighteen. Yep. Is this nineteen or sixty-one? Nineteen. One nine. No, yeah. no, is it is in inverse, right? No, or one is a uh, reverse direction. So one and nine is nineteen. This no, is nineteen. Yeah. Twenty is uh, on the fifth row, left hand one side. One more, one more yeah. minute. Bigger one. Yeah. One more minute to go. Hmm. Middle left. Twenty. Middle left. left. Yeah. Middle, Middle left. left. Twenty. Yeah. Yeah. At twenty-one top side. Top. Go top, top from side. there. This is twenty-one. Yeah. Left. Twenty-two. Left twenty-two Above down side. Side. Eighty-five. Above eighty-five. Down, yeah. down, center down. Second row from the bottom. Above eighty-five. This is twenty-two. Yeah. Twenty-three. This is twenty-three. Twenty-three yeah. is middle. Yes. Yeah. Center of the screen. Twenty-four is top middle. Above nine. Above, above zero yeah. nine. Above zero nine. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. This is twenty-six. Ten more seconds. This is twenty-seven. Uh, top right. Twenty-six, twenty-seven is top right. Twenty-eight, twenty-eight. Left side down. Side. Left bottom. Yeah, left this bottom. is twenty-nine. And twenty-nine just above to twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. Yeah. Up, up. Yeah, time up. Up. Twenty-nine. Yeah. Time up. Time up. Time up. So twenty-nine. We got till twenty-nine. Twenty-nine. So, so Mr. Magesh and the team of Black Belt. Thirty-one. Uh, they got. Don't, wait, wait, wait. Enough. Now <laughs> yeah. the customer is not ready to accept anymore. Right now, twenty-eight. So twenty-eight out of forty-nine. Can somebody tell me what is the value? Twenty-eight out of forty-nine. Almost sixty uh, percent. That is your effectiveness. Sixty percent. And efficiency also, I would say, in terms of time, you have only done you know uh, almost half of it, right? So. What is the problem here? Can somebody tell me why you are highly? Uh, I don't say even uh, no, maybe enough. Uh, maybe uh, let me let me redefine my explanation. Efficiency is clear. Out of uh, the thirty-three minutes, you are expected to figure out to forty-nine numbers, but you actually figured out twenty-eight. That means your efficiency is somewhere around uh, sixty-two. Why your efficiency is lost? First thing is they are not sorted. They are not already sorted in the order. I mean, we cannot define them by the rows and uh, uh, this thing. Yes. Rows you and are, column. While locating the number, when yes. I say three minutes is the time to find out what in a number, how much time do you really have to identify one number? Forty-nine number. You need to find out in one eighty minutes. Sorry, one eighty yeah. seconds. So one eighty divided by forty-nine. One eighty divided by forty-nine. Tell me, somebody. It is roughly uh, three seconds. Three seconds. Three, second, three points. That means that means every three second you should find out one number. 
yes what is this called every 3 second you find out one number this is called tack time tack time <coughs> and we also this is called distributed the work come again we also not distributed that work 1 to 10 or 11 to 20 if we distributed that work the one guy will guide it because there a lot of chaos it created yeah yeah all these reasons you can definitely write down and then you know probably we will play this game once again and then you can see you can implement and see how things improve right and so every 3 seconds you need to figure out one number that is the expectation that is the tag time but what is the reality reality in 180 seconds you found only 28 numbers can somebody tell me what is 180 divided by 28 6.2 seconds 6.2 that means you took 6.2 seconds to figure out each number this is called your cycle time on an average you took 6.2 seconds to produce one output this is an average you need to note this is not 6.2 for each number maybe for 8 you could have taken more time but for 7 you could have taken less time but on an average you took 6.2 seconds to produce one output this is called your cycle time now your cycle time is less than tag time or more than tag time more, more than, than tag time. time so deliveries will never happen on time that is why you have failed in the game always see to that your cycle time is less than the tag time if you keep on reducing your cycle time your no your overall lead time will also come down hope you understand so this is how you can make on time deliveries happen okay and now coming to the no let us realize what actually caused the problem and you when i asked you somebody told you no know, sir we have not divided our work okay you divide your work still i can see you struggling you can do many things many many suggestions and then you can replay the game but what is the task given to you what is the task given to you find out identify the, the numbers identify the numbers from 1 to 49. 49 all that i want is i want only numbers from 1 to 49 but can you see numbers more than 49 also on the screen yes yes i have removed all those numbers Starting. because all these numbers above 49 are not needed that's considered unproductive as far as my current task is concerned first yes so first thing i will do is in fact you no know, we all must do as an organization is we should remove the unnecessary numbers when i remove the unnecessary numbers only the necessary numbers will be left with 1 to 49 now you divide your work now you plan better and then try again definitely you will see your cycle time going down yes if your cycle time goes down your effectiveness will go up your efficiency will also go up is that clear this is the power of first yes just by eliminating the unnecessary items in your workplace your effectiveness improves you have not done anything you have not changed the machineries you have not the you road know, changed your people everything is same what is that you have done you have removed the clutters in your workplace you have removed the unwanted thing first exactly unnecessary items unnecessary activities and going deeper unnecessary thinking can you go to the extent of making people think in your favor this then first yes is implemented at its best clear but the very first step is all the physical items which are not necessary to perform your current job this is the power of this has to be eliminated yes will you be will you be able to do this job very easily yes sir we can do it yes. you can do this job very easily only if you involve everyone in your organization every one should participate every one should know uh, know their zone for example i am sitting in a room 10 by 10 i am responsible for the every square feet of my 10 by 10 room my table and what is inside my table my drawer and my band packet my shirt packet everything i should check and i should see to that i sit 
only with what is needed to perform my job clear and now let us and uh, now in order to further improve in order to further improve my effectiveness further improve my improve my efficiency what i will do is i have seen some of you saying first row second column third row fourth column do it in a better manner now i have put nine boxes that means i have created a house for each item all of us have house so that we are safe even in the last week's flood am i right yes do you want your equipments do you want your materials do you want your items to be safe even in a difficult situation then you must give each item a house that house is nothing but the location the location should be you know very apt to the item your house is how many bedroom you have in your house three bedroom right same way you must design a workplace which will make your item highly convenient inside it should be safer for your item clear and that's how you need to design that is called what set in order set in order now nine addresses are created this is let me say this is first house let me let me go order this manner first row second row third row first column second column and then third column so this is 1 comma 1 yes. this is 2 comma 1 this is 3 comma 1 this is 1 comma 2 1 comma 2 something like that 1 comma 2 2 comma 2 3 comma some name is given now even a security fellow can pick you the item very correctly we no more require mr magesh to help us because address is there isn't it i will tell the address he will go and pick it up i don't want to even use uh, use my security fellow because i think you know he is uh, uh, he is billing me i can even assign this job to a robo now clear a robo will go and pick the item and bring it to me you can you can start from a confusion to a lot of clarity confusion to complete automation that is the power of second yes set in order assign a place for everything and see to that everything is in its place now try to figure out where is your one the one is here in the first house then where should be your two two will be in the second house where is your three it is in the third house now the four four will be in the fourth house somewhere here you can see even a blind fellow can now pick up the item now five will be here you can see six will be here seven will be here eight will be here nine do you find a pattern now one to two one to three is going up and diagonally i am coming down again i am going up diagonally i am coming down i repeat this logic i will find out all the numbers now tell me how much time magesh might require to do the same job items are arranged first of all unnecessary items are removed and then arranged in a proper uh, order and the pattern is also realized and now how much time mr magesh you may take now maybe less than 2 minutes less than 1 minute. minute less than 1 minute beautiful that means your cycle time is coming down below mm -hmm. tag time now you are going to win the game this is what happen in your business also any lean tool please understand this is somehow trying to eliminate some of the waste searching is a wasteful activity why should you search that's my question all of us lose at least 30 to 40 percentage of our life tenure only by searching something this is the statistics we search sometimes our uh, the key of our house also all of us are outside the house we want to lock the house now key is missing this all happens right the traffic policeman is asking us the driving license now we are searching the driving license we are because all the poorly organized you know things will pull down your effectiveness will pull down your efficiency now we are we realize the importance of first years as well as second years clear 
do anything that can be done to make the first two years happen it can be you know uh, creating uh, you know uh, rearranging your layout it can be you know designing uh, your storage space for everything a screw driver or a spanner can be arranged in the number wise i need uh, you know 12 13 or 13 14 or some number of spanner i can quickly pick it up what is that i am uh, eliminating i no need to search a spanner with a particular number i pick it up quickly this is how your cycle time can go down see these are not actually improvements are quite easier we only complicate the improvements do small small improvement your big problem will get solved now this now now a, a new layout earlier i gave nine location now how many locations 49 49 nine. Nine location this is much better earlier i had some difficulty i don't have enough space so i kept you know few items in the same place but now i can further improve now now what do you understand from my screen now font size we have standardized organized the location okay font size if uh, the font size can be standardized but if the it is like an organized way it is kept it is it is more organized and then what else you can observe from my slide we will be forced to keep the numbers in the same location yes yes obviously you can wherever you pick up same place only you should pick it you know place it back very good observation what else you observe blank cells. numbers are missing come again lines blank you numbers are missing 18 ah, or 42 somebody was saying blank what do you mean by that blank uh, missing number ah, missing numbers. numbers are missing how many numbers are missing two three two numbers are missing that means oh, problems will automatically come to the surface the role of the manager becomes easier problems are automatically coming to the surface people just cannot hide problem that is the biggest advantage of practicing the second yes right it gives the visual clue quickly a tool is not stored back in a proper place same day i come to know about it otherwise what happened after 3 months i will find out the tool under my machine what is the use you already replaced it now it becomes an additional inventory isn't it so one waste will cause the other so all the problems will come to the surface if you follow the first two years diligently this is how the benefit accumulates all of you now believe five years can do produce magic results in your workplace but yes. you should you should educate your people on the importance of implementing and following each yes otherwise people just ignore right so five us is a simple organizational strategy that can truly transform your business it improves your efficiency improves your competitiveness hello in fact how it is in fact it is important for your survival also if your workplace is clean and and in proper order you get lot of orders from your customer hope i all of you agree with me right if the workplace is not appealing even the existing customers will walk out they know if you can't even keep your table and workplace neat and clean how are you going to give me a quality product just you no know, as simple as that five us is a system of visual management you see so many address e1 e2 e3 e4 now anybody can do the job effortlessly even a properly trained blind fellow can go and pick the item for you do you believe me now even a blind fellow a blind who is employed in your company he is trained and then he can even do the job for you always you no know, uh simplify the work to the extent possible and ask your employees to do it don't complicate and then expect great results first developed at toyota in 1950s it is the foundation method of lean manufacture the beginning point of your excellence is 5s 
where somewhere you need to start that particular where is 5s then only you can talk about six sigma and other things start with the 5s no matter whether you are a startup or you are a big mnc right or you are a oh, you no know, oem whoever you are your starting point of uh, journey towards excellence is 5s implementing a good 5s will systematically remove unnecessary items unnecessary equipments from production process going deeper it removes unnecessary activities it even will eliminate unnecessary thinking the environment is designed in such a way it will improve your workflow right implementing a good 5s will establish better standards people will be motivated to come to office and work isn't it their attendance will improve their productivity will improve their contribution will improve their growth also will improve if i work in a company you know uh, if, uh, systematically following the five s my growth will will also be faster right and all that it, it assures inclusive growth for everyone so if implemented correctly and then followed diligently five s will lead to lower cost better quality improved safety increased productivity higher employee satisfaction so sort is the process of removing all the items not needed for current current production from the workspace oneness will get rid of problems such as tools 